Hi, I'm Ang Khan from Computer Science. And I'm Jennifer Edmond from Languages, Literatures and Cultural Studies. And we'd like to give you some information about the Trinity Elective, thinking digitally and culturally. If you're watching this, you probably use technology every day. Ideas that were previously the realm of science fiction have become technological facts. 24-7 information access, self-driving cars, have become things that we see every day. However, with these new technologies come phenomena that raise challenges in our societies and how we interact with them. Challenges such as fake news, filter bubbles, and how our private information is shared online are things that we need to understand and address. Many of the foundational elements of our lives are cultural. It's our, our languages, our artistic practices, our values, our norms and beliefs. And the way that technological innovations are driving and disrupting these processes can be really, really hard to disentangle. So in order to do so, you need to learn how to think like an engineer and like a humanist. As part of this Trinity elective, you will learn to apply an interdisciplinary approach to understanding the world. This approach is called Digital Humanities, and it bridges technological and cultural fields to give us new ways of looking at the world. On completion of this Trinity elective, you'll be able to understand the strengths and weaknesses of different approaches to knowledge creation and demonstrate an ability to think and act critically with regards to technology and culture. Produce a group project where you learn to analyse potentially contradictory standpoints on concepts such as data, truth and narrative, and learn to evaluate the outcomes of multidisciplinary work in an informed way. Technologies like big data and AI are becoming more and more a part of the world we live in, and reconciling their effect with our cultural practices can be a great challenge and raise many questions. We look forward to exploring these questions with you.